Hello and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Paranautical Activity. And last time we, we were successful, I believe we had the bow maybe? I can't remember anymore, I'm old and my memory doesn't serve me very well. But this is the first, first, first uh, patch 1.6 episode. And we're kicking it off with the Gilead gun. Patch 1.6 introduces, oh Jesus Christ, a new enemy called the Tenchi Ninja, which is awesome and it is in fact based off good guy Tenchi of uh, of much lore that I have probably spoken about a few times and it also introduces a new mini boss new items uh, and the classes have all been nerfed and Dahlia has been buffed she, they made it so that um, she the, 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 the what are they called the enemies that she spawns don't drop any loot so it's gonna be a little bit more difficult going on here all right so the boss room's right there Mini boss room right here. Who we have? Mothra, huh? All right, fair enough. Okay, let's just kill these little moths if we can. I, I really don't like using the Gilead gun, but I figured I'd kind of mix it up a little bit because I've been using kind of the same three, four weapons pretty consistently now for a little while at least. It's not that it's like a a low damage weapon or anything. It's just that the bullets take so long to travel and it's just not good. I don't think I, I don't like it. I know it's kind of preference now, I suppose, but I don't know. I just, I just don't like using it, you know. I'd much rather use. I kind of wish the M14 was back in the game as like a starting weapon. It's a good weapon, and it's not like overpowered or anything. The shotgun's more overpowered than the ooh sugar finger than the uh, M14. So we got the trigger finger. That's gonna help a little bit. Now we're gonna shoot a little bit faster, at the very least. Who is this? Iris, beautiful. You have beautiful eyes. It's good that we have Iris, though, because uh, those double wings are going to have, or those double, those wings giving us double jump is what I'm trying to say. It's going to definitely help us a little bit along the road here. There is a new item called Gang. Oh, uh, a Gang, or uh, Genghis's soul, I believe, and it inverts gravity when you jump. Kind of am scared to try it out. I haven't gotten it yet. I've played this patch probably two or three times so far, but I haven't haven't gotten the item yet. Kind of scared to get it because it seems kind of like a mind mind f. All right, let's kill Ares here. Let's gonna throw a couple bombs. Those bombs were pretty effective. I'm not complaining about them at all. Jesus, they're like they're really hitting me today. Mostly because they should be dead by now, but the Gilead gun blows. There we go. So I was watching this guy who goes by the name of iDubs on YouTube. He was playing this patch and he beat it in 10 minutes, which is ridiculous. I mean, to be fair, uh, he got really, really lucky with, uh, what is this? Anyways, he got really, really lucky with, with, uh, boss spawn, or boss door spawns. I'm gonna get this. Health up? Okay. But he got very lucky with boss door spawns on the last few levels. So they're like within a couple rooms of the elevator, even one room sometimes. So we got pretty lucky with those, but still impressive nonetheless. He started with a sickle and got some items to help him out a little bit. And then he, he fought Poseidon, got the trident, and just started one-shotting everything. Oh, there's a Tenji Ninja. There's two of them. I'm going to throw a couple bombs. Oh man, they got me. At least one of them got me. Now let's kill his Gilead. He's going to give us a little bit more wiggle room to kind of kite this Tenji Ninja around. The Tenji Ninjas throw Shuriken slash Kunai or whatever you want to call them, as well as Melee. I'm just going to go through a couple more rooms just to get some monies. Some dollar dollar bill, y'all. Throw a bomb at them. Kill this fellow and this fellow. That guy didn't die. There's just bullets flying everywhere. I thought for sure the Gilly would be dead by now, but obviously not. Should be like one or two more hits, right? No? Really? Oh, okay. I guess one of his own friends here killed him. All right by me. Come on, die. This is why I hate the Gilead gun. <laughs> hey there. Oh, I got stuck on the staircase thing, or the walkway. Shouldn't have taken damage there. All right, I'm gonna go down to the next floor. And... Take a sip of coffee. Nope, not yet. Still really hot. <laughs> Just try to switch weapons with Q, because I've been playing a lot of Counter Strike, of course. Do -do 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 -do. 
Which, let's see, where's he? Look, there it is. Hey there, little fellow. Going up. Murdy at 5 out of 8 health. Jeez. Not doing so hot. This could be a short run if I don't get my shit together. I might pick up another gun. The fuck? Uh, if it's like a M14 or something, because again, M14 is real good. Especially if you can get damage ups on it and poison. It scales so well. Okay, I want this moth to die. Be pretty preferable. Or you can just avoid all my shocks. Like some kind of dodgeball master, I guess. That's what I'm trying to say. I don't know. I ain't your mama. I don't know where that came from. I'm sorry. No. I want to find the gift shop and the mini boss room. As always. Guess this one. This room looks pretty good. Throw a couple bombs down here. I only have two bombs left. That's not so good. I don't think they really did a whole lot. You can die any time now. Thank you. Definitely going to try and pick up another gun if I can. Just don't like the Gilead gun. I don't know why I started with it. I guess to kind of change things up a little bit besides the standard you know shotgun crossbow sickle oh tenchi ninja hey the buddy time for you to die I'm stuck there we go seems to be getting stuck I seem to be getting stuck under these stairs a lot in this patch a lot more Jesus tenchi ninja nearby I think I, I thought I killed him, but maybe not. No, he's over there, stuck underneath the stairs, like a chump. Let's kill his Gilead, and fight the boss. Cheating, gonna kill him through the stairs. There we go. Mini boss room through there. It's gonna be Dobie, right? No, Skeleto. Ah, oh, he moved the uh, moved the elevator doors. Totally forgot I had Iris's wings. Like a total scumbag. Throw some bombies, kill these spideys. Alright, I don't like Skeleto. I don't like you. You're a jerk. Ow. Seems enemies are more accurate with their shots nowadays. I don't know. Maybe I just am getting hit more. Die, Skeleto. Come on. Alright. I don't have any bombs. Crap. I need to do some spider control here. Definitely want to pick up another gun. I should have taken the crossbow. You know, you dig? Could really use a bomb though, to be honest. Whoosh. All right, I just want him to die, mostly. Get his item, kill these spiders, and move on with my life. You know? Just stay behind him, and he really can't hit me that well. All right. There we go. Get on top of here. And eat Gilead bullet things, spiders. Uh, come on. Stand still. Let me kill you. Hit, hit, stand, st come on. Thank you. Jerk face. Russell? Oh, one of the new bosses. Mini bosses, I should say. I know the trick to beating her. Hit it, though. I want to kill this Gilead, though. Basically, you gotta let him or her or whatever this is charge you, and then when it kind of does that, just F off. <laughs> Come here. Can't touch this. Meow, 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 meow. Oh. You can see where this would be kind of a difficult boss if you're not kind of familiar with the game, though. Get away, Jesus. It's all up in my grill. So basically, it's just run around, jump away. I think he hit me there, but. Uh, that's okay, I have two armor left, so as long as it's not a heart. Wow, how did you hit me? You didn't even attack. Jesus Christ, stop! Bastard. Get away. You're gonna die right now. I'm calling it. I'm calling it. And by right now, I mean like in two seconds. One Mississippi, two Mississippi. Yeah. Taking the crossbow, I don't care what you guys say. Crossbow for life. Mostly because I hate the other piece of crap, Gilead gun. <clears throat> Excuse me. Okay, where's the gift shop at? Where am I gift shop at? Pre-fire this right now. Boop. Like the the crossbow is good even if you don't get any damage up items. That's how how much I like the crossbow. And, and it's one shots a lot of enemies. Boop. Boop. 
It's a little bit harder to aim, and it's kind of a disadvantage when you're fighting faster enemies, but it's just so fucking good. Whoa, whoa. Die. Oh. Yeah, shoot your buddy for me. That's cool, too. Thanks, friend. Gift shop through here. I just walked right into that bullet. Circle strafe. Like a boss. Kind of upset that... Hey, hey. That I haven't fought in Adobe in a while, though. Or this run, I mean. I fought him like a run ago, probably, but. You know. You know. Just wanna find the gift shop. Don't think it's through there. Probably through here. I had to guess. I don't know. Maybe there's not a gift shop. I don't know. Die. Oh, I missed. Thank you. It's gone to the point where I can kind of like keep my back to the moths and I just know their fire time, like when they when they'll fire next. Alright. Oh there you are, friendy. Hey. There we go. Gift shop. There it is. Oh, attention ninja. Bam. Get out of here. Thank you. Boop. Headshot. Nipple shot. Arm shot. There we go. Okay. Making some decent progress, though. Can't complain at all. Make sure I got all my stuff. Go to the gift shop and then descend. Or actually, it's descend. What do we got here? Vitamin compass. What does that do? Anchor and starfish. Guess I'll take the compass. Oh, reveals map. Okay. That could actually be really useful. Um, it'll make it a lot easier to find the boss room, that's for sure. One thing that I do like, though... Oh, shit, I didn't realize this was a room. <laughs> One thing that I do like, though, for sure, is the fact that uh, there's a level indicator now. So I'm not going to be like, am I on level 5 or 6 anymore? Oop. Okay, attention, Ninja, you die now. There you go, you did die now. See, I can predict the future. So long as it's like four seconds into the future. Don't ask me to predict the future, though. Because I can only do it once. That was a pretty good barrel shot. Is my coffee cool enough yet? Yeah, I guess so. I hope so. Mm, that's some good coffee. It is, though. It is. Nice and, uh... Coffee tasting. Alright. I really like this compass item. Jesus, I don't even have to, like, run around with my head cut off. Alright, I just have to kill this Gilead and I can head straight to where I need to go. And that'll make it, this run a lot faster, for sure. As long as I can keep myself alive, that is. Eh, really? There we go. Shot him right in the leg. Boop. Oh, there's Axis on the third floor now. That's pretty nifty. I guess. Oh god, I almost walked right into it. Seriously, Moth? Alright. Die. Thank you. Oh god. Jimby! Jimby! I said Jimby, seriously. Eh. There you go. <laughs> Little scamp. I'm gonna go into the mini boss room first before I do anything. And then the gift shop. This compass is probably the best item in the history of mankind. I don't have to spend half an hour running around and looking for a room anymore. I can make this as quick as possible. I mean, unless you guys like long episodes, I don't know. Alright, I need you to stop charging me, though. Be pretty nice of you. Don't know how that hit me. I guess maybe I jumped into it. I don't know. I thought I avoided it pretty well, though. Alright, two more hits. Wait, three more. One more. One more now. No? What? There we go. What is this? Magnet. Awesome. Makes it so that I can be lazy as hell. It's kind of no point in going to the gift shop right now, though, because I don't really have any money. <laughs> Where? Oh, hey there. That was terrifying. And you can have a, a arrow. And you can have an arrow. And so can you. Arrows for everyone. I don't discriminate. That's for discrimination, Dan. Who is a good friend of mine, even though he's very much so 
Green's ovaries. I don't know what those do. I'm gonna save it for the flip-flops, though. I should probably look up what some of these new items do. I know the starfish lets you revive after you die. Um, the uh, iron heart, I think it's called, gives you unlimited health, so you can pick up hearts and it'll like add to your health. You have more max health. There's no cap to your max health, basically, so you can say like 8 out of 8, but I can get a heart and I'll make it so I have 9 out of 8, essentially. It's pretty cool, pretty powerful. I think Green's Ovaries, if I remember correctly, makes the invincibility timer after you get hit slightly higher. Could be wrong. I probably am, but I think that's what it does. Eh. Eh. Oh, that was a bad choice. <laughs> or bad timing on that shot, rather. I mean, it hit the guy, but it was at the expense of a health. Hey there. Whoa. Okay. I like, I like the axes, they take care of the enemies for me. Bam. Wait. Bam. Hey there. Surprised he didn't shoot me right when I walked up to him. <laughs> Alright, let's go and get those flip-flops to make our life a little bit easier down the road here. And then we'll go down to the, or up to the next floor, up to the fourth floor. See, I know that, because there's a level indicator. Thank you. Walk on lava. Boss room this way. Really digging the new items so far. <laughs> oh, Poseidon. So, just gonna do like a little Gatling gun here. I'm tempted to take the Trident, but I'm not good enough to do that. Do 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 do. Easy boss, easy mode. I'm tempted, but well, you know what? I have the magnet. Let's do it, guys. Let's do it. Eh. Eh. I haven't used the trident in a very long time, so I think it's, uh... It's after that I use it now. Oh god. Oh god. Eh. Good thing is, it one-shots everything. Well, not everything, but most enemies. Eh. I completely missed. You gotta hit him, though, for it to be effective. Did I kill that... Yeah, I guess I killed that skull thing. Scorch. Hmm. Look at that. Skill. What's in here? Blowfish. For 350. Bomb box, bomb box. Definitely gonna save it for the blowfish. Um, no doubt about it. Whoa! Eh. That was a horrible throw. I keep thinking these, uh... Uh... Oh, fuck you! Dickhead. I keep thinking these axes are moths. Did I get him? No. Get him! Get him! Thank you. Oh, okay. I guess that works too. Catch it. So hopefully I don't die here. That will be embarrassing. Alright. Let's run away. Mm. Didn't get him. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. I'm scared. <sighs> Where is my trident? Come on! I didn't get it. Eh. Come on, give me my trident back. Oh! Alright, fuck you. There we go. Just gotta be a little bit aggressive with this thing, I guess. That's how- oh, hey there. Keeps going between their legs, it's pretty annoying. Surprised I didn't get hit there by the explosions. Uh, who's this boss gonna be? Hopefully it's someone easy. Yeah! Speed up will be very much a pre- Look how much damage this thing does, it's ridiculous. That's probably why it's not a starting weapon anymore. <laughs> Alright, speed up is gonna be nice though. I could just head right up there, but... I do wanna fight the mini-boss, which is like... The mini-boss is like in... Fucking... East New Brunswick or some shit. I do want that blowfish though. Eh. Oh god, I need to go. Oh! Jesus, come here. Eh. Alright, moths, you're next. Because I have the iris wings, I can kind of just jump right up to them. And I have the magnet, which is the best thing in the world right now. Especially with the with the trident. Although, the trident's a little bit better with now that you have... Or even if you don't have the magnet, now that the... The, uh... Fuck! 
now that the short range magnet is a thing. Jesus, that was crazy right there. Wow, how did that hit me? Come on. Let's be realistic here. I mean, I understand it's not really a realistic game, but, you know, be nice. Pretty close to being able to afford the blowfish now. Scorches, where are they? Come on, die. Thank you. Eh, eh. Okay, where's a Gilead? No Gilead yet, I don't think. Alright, beautiful. It's probably gonna be the jellyfish watch. No, oh god, what is this? Oh, it's a spider. I just saw Jim Bob, Bob Boy come flying at me from the ceiling. I got scared. Yeah. Definitely added more Jim Bob Boys to the spider boss, I think. Mini boss. What is this? Screw your M14. Can't afford the blowfish yet, though. So I need to... To change that. How? How is that thing hitting me? Wait! I have flip-flops, though! What? That's not fair. I definitely picked up the flip-flops. Did I not? I need to write an angry letter to Michael about this. Flip-flops don't work, unless he's fixing it today. That's just not fair, Mike. Come on. You cheated me. If I lose this, because I can't walk on lava, even though I had the flip-flops, I'm gonna be upset. Yeah. Come here, come at me. Eh. Eh. These guys are really easy now that I have the, uh. Whatever this thing is. Trident. Oh. I got them both. I think I took damage from the stupid Axis. There are traps in this game now, though. They're arrow traps. I don't even think I really need the. the blowfish, to be honest, but it'll be nice, I suppose. Guess I have to go back. Okay. Okay, I can do that. Don't touch the lava, because fucking flip-flops don't work. Asshole. Asshole flip-flops, not the, uh, not the dev. Eh. Oh, thanks for killing yourself there, Mothra. Boop. I just booped him. That was the worst throw in the history of mankind. I should probably definitely not join the Olympic javelin tossing event. Need 25 more gold. If I didn't pick up those flip-flops back there, I'm going to be pretty upset. But I'm pretty sure I picked them up, and I'm, I shouldn't have been taking damage on the lava. Pretty sure I picked them up. Maybe I didn't, though. I could be I could be wrong. Maybe I just didn't know. Yeah, I definitely did, though. Like, I definitely picked them up. There's no doubt about it. No doubt in my mind at all. Um, let's go over to these rooms. Just need 25 more gold. If I'm short one gold, I'm going to be very upset. Oh. Come here. Oh, I didn't think that hit him for a second. Eh. There's a lot of gillies in this room, man. Eh. Guy has no kneecaps now, which is pretty sweet for me. Okay, where's the moth? There you are. Little champ. Alright. 368, plenty of money now. I'm gonna go get the blowfish and continue on to floor 5. Come here, you little little guy, you. I have 21 bombs, I need to start throwing bombs. I don't really need to, but... It's gonna come in use in handy, rather, for Dahlia. Should I get there? Ah, sorry, I was drinking coffee. That's why I was walking like that. <laughs> Alright. Alright, so boss rooms to the... Whoa, to the right. I'm gonna go this way. Well, hmm. Yeah, I'm gonna go this. Whoop, nope. I would go that way, but I can't walk on lava. <laughs> Jesus Christ, monkeys. <laughs> oh! Okay, okay. I can get out of this. I got out of it. Oh god, stop going in the corner, you idiot. Jesus. That was horrible. I didn't know the monkeys were going to be, like, immediately right there. I mean, no one would ever know, but it was still pretty pretty cheap of them to do that. I kind of want this thing to explode so I can move on with my life. Get him. Get him, Trident. 
All right, I'm gonna go kill this moth. And uh, hmm. Okay, come here. Actually, don't come here. Just go up, please. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, I'll head to the boss room. All right, not boss room. Oh fuck! What am I doing? Eh. Thank you. For, thanks for that. Oh, I guess he didn't give me health, dickhead. Maybe he didn't. I already lost it. I don't know. Yeah. All right. I'll save the Boomba for last. Just cuz. Okay, where'd he go? There he is. Yeah. Really? That didn't hit him? Come on. Thank you. Jeez Louise, man. Uh, no. Not really anything particularly good here. Kind of concerned. <laughs> I mean, I don't have that good of items. I had the blowfish, but I mean, uh, oh, arrow traps. Got to wait. Wait. Go. Eh. Come here. Let me kill you. Okay. Well, they're not so bad now that I can melee them. I don't have to really line up my shots at all. Ah, oh, fuck it. Oh, okay. Spiga, or whatever your name is. Spiga, Spuga, Spaguka. Luckily, the trident's OP. Eh. Eh. And you're dead. Wow. I need to kill all these egg sacs, I guess. <laughs> One bad thing is that it's gonna be a pain in the ass to kill these spiders. Although I have 21 bombs, it shouldn't be that bad. Throw a bomby. Throw another one. As long as I stay away from them, away from them, it shouldn't be all that bad. Ugh. Nailed it. This should kill them all. And you. Wait for it. Wait for. Huh. Nope. Huh. Nope. Huh. Oh. Oh. Seriously. Ugh. Worth it. I think this is damage up, right? Not that I really need damage up, but you know, I'll take it. Who is it? Oh, this guy. This guy's a chump. He'll probably kill me, but you know. Still a chump. Did I kill that moth? Yes, I did. Whoa! That was a triumphant throw. That was 300 worthy. Just two shot at him. Beautiful. Alright, there we go. Get away. Not really anything particularly good as for drops. I mean. I guess I'll have to manage and kind of head to the boss room as quickly as I can, but it's not looking that good. Coffee break. So mini boss to my right. Uh, after this room. This shouldn't be too bad. Right? Right? Ow. Ow. Alright, I would really like to kill these lectors. And then I can focus on the monkeys that are surely chasing me. Come here, Lecter. I jumped right over him. Oh god, I'm dead. Fuck, what? Ah! Oh well. That was 1.6, the first episode for 1.6. I mean, didn't do that well. I feel like we kind of got screwed because we couldn't walk on the lava. Because um, apparently the flip-flops don't work in this patch. But, uh, as always, thank you for watching. And see you next time.